Guys, I just spawned in this world. I'm not even joking. This is where I spawned. This has got to be the weirdest... <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, we're starting to... This house is completely underground. Hold on. Three. What? You can't do that anymore? Uh oh, okay, it's not completely underground, but still. Okay, that was a pretty cool um, place to spawn. What? Okay, that's really annoying. Uh. You have to type the whole thing out every time. Okay. Uh, well, guys, welcome to the video anyway. Uh, so today, what we're going to be doing is... I know it's a little bit late. I'm sorry about that. Uh, but we're going to be going over 1.13 because this is an absolute crazy update. Um, you guys all know it. I'm sure you've heard all about it and you probably even played it yourself. So, um, I'm not going to go through every, every like, uh piece of it because there's like a lot <laughs> I'm just gonna go through my favorites um, and maybe maybe you'll see something that you didn't know maybe maybe not but uh, I hope you guys enjoy so here we go okay so the first one uh, oh my goodness there's a fish oh by the way uh, I haven't actually this is my first time playing uh, one point th I played it for like five minutes but that was just to make a thumbnail so I didn't really do anything with the update wouldn't it um, so I haven't had a chance to download it. I've been kind of like off, off, uh, like good internet basically. Uh, so this is my first time, like I I have not I I haven't played with it. So uh, the first thing I want to do uh, that looked really cool on my on my to be favorite list uh, is bubble columns. So that means soul sand. Oh gosh, um, here it is. What is it? Oh, magma glock. Glock. That's it. Okay. I was thinking magma cream. Well, no, that's it. Uh, okay, so uh, yeah, there we go. Okay, so these things lift you up. So if I walk into this real quick, boom! You go, wow, you get like shot out of the water. Okay, and then these magma blocks should drag you down. I think. Yeah, there they go. Okay, so I'm getting sucked to the bottom, and then I'm getting pushed to the top, so that would be really cool if you're building an elevator or something. Uh, I just think those things are really cool. Okay, so the second one uh, that I want to do is the trap door. So as a builder, um, these are going to be really nice. So before, um, let me just grab all these five, okay, there we go. Uh, before, all you had was... No. All you had was this trapdoor, and it got really boring, especially when you wanted to do different kinds of like house construction or any any kind of build, but usually houses. But now you can actually have different kinds of trapdoors, like spruce doors, birch doors, jungle, acacia. Wait, acacia. I, whatever. I can never remember how to spell that. Whatever. Uh, this one actually looks like a uh, chocolate bar to me. If you put two of them next to each other. I bet someone who didn't play Minecraft would think that was a chocolate bar. <laughs> okay, so number three. I wish we had like a bigger area. Uh, I probably could have... Uh, can I fly? Thank you. <laughs> uh, I probably could have like scouted out for a bigger for bigger water. Uh, I don't see any. Uh, that's kind of close over there. I mean, cool. Uh, so this is coral. Um, and I just really like how colorful it is, basically. Um, I always liked the uh, my, uh, not map mods. Uh, it was like more biomes. I loved the sea because it was uh, it was just like it was so pretty because they had all this coral and it was so colorful. Before Minecraft, Minecraft would just look like this. Okay, that's that's, that's this is just so boring. But now we have all this color um, and there's a whole bunch more that I didn't actually get because I ran out of inventory space. Uh, so oh, there was one more. <laughs> uh, but there's all of this stuff too. I can't even grab it. Come on, uh, all of this. Um, besides these coral blocks. So I just think this is so pretty and it's one of my favorites. Uh, is can you plant this? Yeah, you can. Uh, and then you just keep stacking it up. Make it, can you make it go above the water? No, you can't actually make it. You can't make it go above the water. That's the highest you can make it. Uh, but still, that's really cool. You can make uh, like kelp forest. Just, I don't know. I think you could do so much. Uh, making like underwater gardens and just just going crazy. 
Going off of what I said uh, about making these nicer for building, I think these are also going to be really good. Um, before you had prismarine blocks and prismarine slabs, and of course you had uh, like the dark prismarine and the prismarine uh, blocks and the prismarine bricks. Okay, that's it. There we go. Uh, but now you actually have all those and you also have stairs out of them. So these are going to be really cool. I think that I think that every block should have um, should have one of these. I, I just it makes it so much nicer for building um, because if you look um, oh, uh, there we go. Uh, th there's like 10 different types, gosh, 10 different kinds of stairs. Uh, and of course, these three were new. Sea pickles! They help light up your area. Um, I think they're so cool as well. I think you can eat them if you're in survival. And also, sea grass is gonna make the uh, ocean look a lot uh, just nicer in general. Uh, and of course, who doesn't love pickles? Yeah, n nobody, absolutely nobody. So these are gonna be really nice. Uh, and, and they're really useful, you know, you can eat them, you can just stick them on the ground for light. And I also think it's really cool that um, you can like add more to, to your blocks, you can just be like, stick them down here. Wait, did I? Oh, hold on. I, I didn't talk of- I did, uh, <laughs> wait, oh, right, I forgot. Uh, that's coming up, you guys. Don't worry. Uh, about the kelp, I forgot, you can actually craft into blocks and eat it. No, you can eat it or craft it into blocks, I mean, and you can build with those blocks, uh, or you can just use them for storage, so that's, oh, oh, <coughs> uh, excuse me, sorry, um, so that's really cool, uh, going back to the kelp, going back on land once more to the building, uh, I'm sure you've all noticed, or maybe noticed, you've probably heard, um, that you can now, uh, strip wood. So you have this really nice and clean looking, um, did I skip one? Yeah, I did. Really nice, clean looking wood, uh, it's like, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, basically how you make is you take an axe, you just fly over to a tree right here, uh, and you can just, uh, skin it. It would be really cool if you got, like, whoa, was, whoa why was I so afraid of that pig? Um, it would be really cool if, like, when you, when you skinned it, you would get, um, stripped sorry I was thinking like skinned isn't the right word you can't skin a tree you can strip one though uh, you would get something from it but uh, that's fine I think I th once again I think it's really gonna help with building because you know the the four wait hold on <laughs> one two three four well there's six because the six normal woods they do get pretty old after a while you know like how many times do you see do you see like it's boring look at this so Hopefully these are going to be a lot more interesting. I'm excited for them. Moving on, we're getting into some, uh, some mob stuff. So here we have, uh, these are really cool. You have turtles and turtle eggs. Uh, can you place these in the water? No, you can't. Uh, yeah, we're just going to, yeah. <laughs> um, so like the sea pickles, you can't, oh, nope. Uh, you can like stack these in one block. So those are really cool. I don't actually know how they hatch. So you just wait. I, f I forget, maybe you can feed them stuff. Uh, but you also have turtles. Look at these guys. They're so cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, and I think, I'm not exactly, no, they're leaving. I thought maybe, <laughs> I just kicked him. Uh, I thought maybe the, um, they might like stay around the, the eggs. I'm not, I'm not exactly sure. Set time. Oh, it's time set. <laughs> Slash time set zero. Okay, good, I can still do that. That would have been even worse. I guess no, because day is not hard to type. But, like, having to type creative, I don't know, first world problems. Uh, so this, uh, the slow falling, here we- oh. No, yeah, yeah, here we go. Um, potion. Slow falling. Here's this. So, if we actually go ahead and drink this up here. Uh, we actually fall slowly and we won't take any fall damage. So this, uh, I, it, like, it's cool. I don't know if I'll use it or not, but I just thought it was really cool. Um, cause I don't play all that much survival as, as a, like, a builder. Uh, so. Another mob we have is the Phantom. These are really cool. Uh, these come out... Thank you. These come out if you haven't slept in a few days. Look at the- oh. 
there we go sorry about that here i'll spawn some more so these guys are really creepy they spawn if you haven't slept in a few days um and i'm not exactly sure wh what they do <laughs> but but they're pretty spooky so st stop yeah and they do burn in the daylight as you guys were just noticing so i'm gonna um yes these guys are like the zombies of the sea zombies of the sea yeah so they're pretty cool <gasps> it's a baby one he's got a trident trident speaking of tridents wait wait i thought there were more tridents in this whole one huh <laughs> very interesting I don't know why I did that. Uh, so these you can uh, you can throw his stuff, and uh, and you can go pick them up too. So boom. Uh, how much damage do they do? One uh, nine attack and damage. That's pretty good. The sword does seven, so that's that's pretty strong. Uh, the only thing is you can only use it once, and then you have to go pick it up. I'm not sure. Can you craft them? What's the crafting recipe for this? I, I don't. I don't really don't know. Uh, I think it's cool that that like they just stick in the ground because not a lot of minecraft stuff can just like stick in the ground like this i think it's a cool animation I, maybe it's just me but <laughs> but moving on this is probably like my favorite one besides uh, maybe dolphins or something um but fish for so long i have wanted oh not silver fish tropical fish puffer fish uh wait what's the other one tropical fish puffer fish Fish fish. Oh, salmon. I want salmon. There we go. I think these are three times. I might be wrong. I'm not sure. Uh, so let's just go over here a little. Oh, we see some natural stuff. Is there like a uh, there's like a nice long river over here? I'm trying to find some place a bit bigger. Oh, there's a swamp. There's usually open spaces in the swamp. Okay, here we go. Uh, so is there anything special about a swamp, by the way? No, it's just like normal seagrass, lily pads, all that good stuff. So here we go. Um... Now before, the only mention of fish that you could, like the only time you could ever notice a fish is if you're fishing, okay? But here you can actually see them. Uh, so here we have salmon, um, and they're actually like moving mobs, unlike before, they were just bubbles that you could see along the surface. So these are so cool. Um, I'll say tropical fish, and then we have puffer fish. So these guys, they're tiny, holy moly. Oh, right, because they get bigger. <laughs> um, so if you touch them, I think they hurt you, poison you, or something. I don't remember. And then these are my favorite. Um, hold on, if we can get a um, uh, water bucket. I don't remember if it's a water bucket or bucket. Uh, so there's, I forget, it's like, a, uh, it was like 300 or 3,000. I don't know. There's a ton of these, okay? Uh, so, I mean, they're just so pretty. And also what's really cool about them, if you... Um, <laughs> sorry is if you want to build an aquarium you can just swim over there we go um and you can just plop them in the water over here Oop. yeah wait will it be the same pattern fish uh i'm not sure where, where even was i here we are okay so if i take a clown fish right here i can't even okay ready this purple and purple and Hold on. <laughs> uh, I guess you have to have water in the bucket. It won't just fill by itself. Uh, they're all like swarming over here. I wonder if they do that on purpose or it's just luck. I'm not sure. So this purple and... There we go. Purple and yellow fish. So if I put that over there, is it going to be the same? Oh, it is. That's so cool. So um, also this means... Oh yeah, they are swarming. I think that's like a special feature. It's not just... Look at them go! They're so cool! Uh, so if you wanted, if you weren't like creative and you're like, uh... Oh, wait, hold on. There we go. Wait, nope, 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 hold on. Oh, nope. Tropical fish. <laughs> Why did that take so long? So if you're like building a fish tank and you only want... Oh my goodness. We need water again. If you only want, like, this one fish, um, then you can like spawn a bunch over here until you get it, and then you can just go to your aquarium. I'm just like, boom, a billion of these fish. So that's, that's cool. While we're in the water over here, swimming with all these fish, hold on, let me get tropical fish out. Nope, nope, there we go. Oh, those are puffer fish. 
Why am I so confused when switching between these? It's so weird. Uh, okay, so while we're in the water with all these fish, it's weird, all these tropical fish in a swamp. Uh, well, anyway, while I'm in here, oh, I'm standing, hold on. Uh, we actually have a really cool swimming animation. Um, so we're doing like a little breaststroke here. Uh, what do we do on the surface? We just do the same thing. Okay. Uh, so this looks really cool, um, and it's a lot better than before. I'm sure you guys know what it, it was like this before. Okay, this is how you swim. This was the only way you could swim in Minecraft before uh, this 1.13 upquate. Up, up, upquate? What is an upquate? Sounds like a kumquat mixed with an update. Uh, an upquate. Anyway, this is the this is uh this is really cool. So I I really like this. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, another awesome thing that was added is dolphins. Okay. This is so cool, so you can just spawn a bunch of these, and like wolves, if you do attack one of them, they're all going to come after you. So, you know, be careful, um, even though they are really cool. I don't think you can tame them or anything. I might be wrong. I'd have to go check that, but I, to my knowledge, I don't think you can. Uh, there's not a whole lot. Oh, no, no, they gave you like a speed boost underwater if you're around them. Um, I, I think that's about it. Um, so another one of my, uh, up there with like the fish and the dolphins, okay? This is gonna be so cool. If you guys don't know this already, it's gonna blow your mind. So basically, you can now place blocks that aren't full blocks underwater, and it won't look stupid. I'm sure you know, uh, let's see, what else are there? Uh, like stairs and stuff. I have run into this problem so many times where stairs would look awful underwater because you would have like a, uh, block of air right here um, where where there's no block and it would be so annoying and especially with like iron bars and stuff uh, you just have this air block down here and it was just ugly and awful so I'm really glad they added this in this is so cool oh we started swimming again hello <laughs> um, and our last one oh they're following me that's so cute Aww. Uh so our last one oh I got I got the dolphins grace thing yeah uh, so our last one, uh, we're just gonna we're just we're just gonna fill our inventory with with oh, oh there we go, <laughs> uh, and this is the items float now okay, um, I'm I really hope I added this in the video I had a sky block uh, where I even said like oh it would be so great if Mojang made items float um, I don't remember how long ago but it was before this I'm not sure if the snapshots were out yet or you know um, I'm not sure if like it was something that people had known yet. But I didn't know it, and I just, I, I, yeah, that was cool, so, maybe Mojang was listening. Anyway, these things now float, so you can see them starting to float up right now. Uh, let's throw them down a little bit, so you can see them. And there they go, they're floating up. So, uh, that's gonna be really helpful if you're building in survival, especially like if you- Look at- oh, look at the dolphins! That's so funny, they're like swimming around with the- uh, with a, I, have, I didn't know they jump. I mean, I, I know they. I guess I assumed they jump. I never. S Whoa! <laughs> I don't know if that's a realistic jump. Well, I, I don't know. I've never seen a dolphin. I don't know if you can turn directions and head the other way in midair, but you know, it works. Uh, I think that's it. Yeah, so as I said, I know I'm missing a lot, um, but you guys have probably already know. Most of most of the 1.13 stuff, uh, I just wanted to share with you my favorites, and of course, there's all these new uh, structures like uh, sunken ships, sunken ships, and buried treasure, etc. Whatever. <laughs> but these are my favorites, so I hope you guys do enjoy. If you guys have some favorites that I didn't uh, um, showcase in here, feel free to leave them in the comments. Uh, and tell me which one is your favorite, um, whether I've covered it or not. Um, I'll be excited to see what you guys think. Uh, so thank you guys so much for watching, and have a great rest of your day, everyone. I'll see you next time. Bye.